Last summer, we took a family vacation to Siesta Key. For those not familiar, Siesta Key is a barrier island in the Gulf just off the coast of Sarasota, Florida. One day of vacation, we went kayaking through the mangrove tunnels on Lido Key. If you're looking for some fun in Sarasota, Florida, kayaking through the mangroves is something you must try. But there are a few things that you might want to be aware of, and this video can give you a little bit of insight. So here it is, our experience on a fun three-hour kayaking excursion through the mangroves. Cora, Cora, Cora. So we are getting ready to go kayaking through the mangroves. It's like a three hour trip. We'll see what this is like. I've been kayaking a few times, so I feel like I got a pretty good grip on that. Hopefully it's an easy navigation because we decided not to do the guided tour. We decided to just adventure out on our own. We'll find out if that was a good choice or not. <laughs> I guess they give you a map. We got three hours to navigate through these mangroves. I think it's gonna be fun. At this point in the video, you might be thinking, James, what the hell is a mangrove? The truth is, I'm not an expert, but we got the internet and here's what it says. A mangrove is a salt tolerant tree or shrub that grows in tropical coastal swamps. They typically have numerous tangled roots above ground and form dense thickets. Mangroves are adapted to live in harsh coastal conditions and serve as productive ecosystems for various life forms. We first learned about the mangroves on our visit to the Moat Aquarium. If you haven't seen our video on the Moat Aquarium, go check it out. We're here. I'm excited. Me too. I hope we see something cool. <laughs> this is so cool. Hey, bud. What do you think? Good. We'll see if we should have done a guided one in a little bit. We were given a laminated map and immediately told that it was not the most accurate. The guide showed us the best route to take and where we could find certain animals. Okay, so we're going to try and follow the directions. Bye, Mommy. Um, we're going to try and listen to this tour guide here. If you're terrible with directions, you might want to take the guided tour. We should have. Plus, you'll probably learn and see more. Cora just manning the boat all by herself. Because Randy's been on the GoPro and her phone the entire time. That is not true. I just did the GoPro before we even started paddling, really. I have been paddling. Oh my gosh. She's so, seriously so dramatic. Ugh, teenagers. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Oh wow. Here you go. We're at the mangrove. There's this one thing that you might want to be aware of before booking, and that is... There are a lot of crabs. Yes, crabs. There were small, dark crabs everywhere. At first glance, they appeared to be giant spiders on the tree branches. And some of those branches you have to go underneath. Ew, don't hit the branches. She's running us into branches and over all of these branches. <laughs> Cora's freaking out because these crabs are crawling all over these trees everywhere. I read that sometimes the crabs have to jump into the water to escape predators. Ah, no! I said you can't go left. <gasps> Brandy! Oh my gosh. <laughs> go faster, please. <laughs> I'm freaking out. It was funny watching the ladies creep out over the crabs, but I thought they were kind of cute. Oh, stop it. Here we are in the mangroves. I don't know exactly where we're at because I know I've said in the past how really bad I am about directions. And pretty much came out of the first little thing and I'm like, I'm completely lost. I have no idea. The water is very shallow and there's just little fish. You can see some crabs and some shells. The biggest thing that you see is birds. Um, and like a million crabs, which I'm so thankful for the Facebook person that warned me about that. So I had time to research and mentally prepare Cora because 
she I did not get mentally prepared. I knew about him, I did not mentally prepare. <laughs> she is such a girly girl. They're just everywhere. Like that's why we don't hit trees. Because Hey, you hit some trees too. I know. I'm gonna grab one and throw it at you. Jam James, you do that and I will file for divorce and mm -hmm. immediately when we get home. Yeah, we don't do that, huh, Dad? If you rent the two-person kayaks as we did and tree crabs creep you out, you'll want to avoid running into things. Be sure to put the most experienced rower in the back. The lady struggled a bit. Back up, back up. We're in a kayak, babe. You can back up. I forgot how much people argue during kayaks. Hey, Mama. Look at us go. Look at us go. We're turning around. Might not be the appropriate way. Cora had a leaf fall into our kayak. <clears throat> she almost died. She thought it was a crab. <laughs> she almost fell out of the kayak. Cora, Cora, Cora! <laughs> 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 mommy and Cora over there. As you coast through these mangrove tunnels, you can see all these little creatures in the water. This is beautiful. <gasps> a starfish! Right there! James, can you get a picture of that that live starfish? Where are we going? Are we branching off to the left or are we going? Hi! Hi! <laughs> When we got out into the open bay, the fish were jumping out of the water everywhere. There are fish that keep popping out of the water out here. Oh, there was one out there. Oh, they're everywhere. Did you guys get one of those popped onto my boat? We'd be in. There's a good spot where you can see dolphins and manatees, so we headed that way. There was one dolphin off in the distance, but it took off before we could get near. We did get very close to a manatee, though. Hello, Mr. Manatee. Corey, he's right there. Brandy tried to record it, but was unsuccessful. He's right there. I can see this. Well, go around it. Go around. Go. Oh, that duck just scared the shit out of me. I see his back. Oh, there's a little ducky. No, that's a... Can you see the water right there, Corey? That's where he's at. Right there. The water flattens out. He's right there. Right. Oh, he's right there. Oh my gosh. chasing this manatee just a little bit ago. Got right up over him. We were chasing him around, he eventually took off. We were kind of surrounding him. He probably felt a little threatened. The manatee didn't really want to hang with us that day, but we did make some friends with the ducks. There were these pretty playful ducks that followed us and they were swimming under the kayak and popping up on the other side. I'm not sure if they were ducks or geese or whatever, but they were pretty cute. Brandy was trying to call him over like she would a cat, like making kissing noises, like. We get it. Oh, get him on our. Hello, guys. All right, they're all gonna come up. Oh. <laughs> ah. <laughs> 
kayaking is tons of fun and also a great way to get huge muscles, especially when you're the one doing all the work. Right. We've got to have huge biceps, ladies and gents. We're going to join the competitive kayaking team because we had to outrun a boat. I'm out of breath. My arms hurt, but we are professional kayakers. All you professionals should be very afraid of the Middle East. No, not the Middle East. Midwest, not Middle East. Mom, Pelican. <laughs> Hello, Pelican. Oh, there he's moving. <laughs> Where are you doing, Joe? The mangroves are really pretty, and kayaking is always so much fun. Our family had a blast, and we highly recommend booking this excursion through Kayaking SRQ Tours and Rentals. If you like paddle boarding, they also have paddle boards to rent. If you go in the summer, we suggest that you book early in the day so that it's cooler and don't forget your sun protection. Kayaking through the mangroves can be a great excursion if you want to get a workout in. While tree crabs cheer you on. Keep rowing, you got this, bro. If you're in the area and enjoy kayaking, you got to check out the mangrove tunnels in Sarasota, Florida. Great experience. I think everybody enjoyed it. No. You didn't enjoy it? You didn't have fun? No, because those crabs. There were a lot of crabs, but it was awesome. We thought originally three hours was going to be a bit too much. It really wasn't. It was a good time. Highly recommend it. Tap the like and subscribe.